Morning guys, Monday morning and we've been a bit quiet on the old YouTube front but we've been pretty busy on the farm and uh, we are just loaded up with the uh, trailer we're off to catch unfortunately the same lamb that we had last year that got fly strike and nearly died twice and the little thing's got it again and uh, we're due to shoot in the next week hopefully uh, but this one's got some maggots on its back so I need to go and grab it, chuck it in the trailer and then uh, get it in quarantine and treat it so uh, keep you posted who said sheep farming was easy so we've caught the girl and as you can see she's got a bit of a poo bum so we're going to get her back to the farm and uh, get her treated, get her dagged out and sprayed that wasn't easy Okay guys, now we're back in the paddock area where we've uh, fenced off this wee lamb. Lucky, I don't know if she's called Lucky again this year. Same problem last year, twice she had fly strike. And um, literally in the last couple of days, she's just ended up with a really bad pooey bum. And uh, if you can see just deep in there, we've got some maggots already forming. Not the nicest of things, so we're just gonna get her dagged out now and get her sorted and yes I'm out of breath because I've been running around the field trying to jump on her right guys we're gonna old fashioned way of dagging out we're just gonna get some of this more off the back here Definitely would be easy with shearers. So, guys, we've spent the best part of a good 10, in fact, probably 20 minutes, trust me, on the old fashioned shears here. So, you can see here we've cleared away a lot of this uh, wool from here. And we've got a little bit of a, a cut here, and we've had a lot of poo on a bump because she's uh, a typical Ryland, which is full. So, we've got a really good cut back. They are being shared in the next few weeks, um, but what we've done here is just giving it a short back in size, like myself, and then we're going to give it a bit of a spray, keep an eye on it, keep it out the field so we can keep an eye on it, but I think we've caught it just in time, um, with a couple of maggots around here, not as deep um, as last year, so you can see there the little small ones there, but we've seemed to have just caught it in time. So uh, we're going to spray it up and we'll, uh, we'll see how we get on. When you think you've got a quiet morning nothing's ever quiet on the farm always got something to do and i've got lessons in a bit so we need to get on with this but uh, this is lucky lucky last year got fly strike twice and as i said earlier today we're due to get her uh, all the sheep sheared and uh, in the last couple of days she's got a bit of a pooey bum and um, there we go she's ended up having to be manually sheared by me this morning uh, I think I'm going to definitely invest in some of the uh, battery operated shears um, so we can at least save a bit of time we can get straight down to the bone give it a good spray, give it a good treat so we can get some antibiotics in her later today because uh, we've not got any on farm so we'll get to the vets but yeah, so we're going to keep her in quarantine keep her away from the other sheep we don't want to sort of infecting the rest of the flock and uh, see how she goes <laughs> 